Hello and welcome to the world of Ur. I'm Lorne, your host and guide through these unfamiliar, wild, and savage lands. And today we're going to be picking up right where we left off with our blind let's play of Moonlighter. Um, it's been a lot of fun so far, and I think we're just gonna we're just gonna jump right into it. So um, where we left off, it was night. Uh, we just kind of did a cheap little thing of going back into the dungeon and back out. Ooh, let's uh, let's do this. Nope. There we go. Alright, we're just gonna head back into the dungeon. See what we got. See what we got going. <clears throat> At this point, we're gonna be kinda saving money for some of the upgrades, I think. Uh, I mean, as if there's anything else to save it for, I don't know. I don't know what I mean by that exactly. Excuse me. All right, and in we go. Round three or four or what have you of the gold dungeon. Easy here, got some, I think those were teeth stones. I'm starting to remember what stuff's called. I guess not that easy, we got whacked by the red guy. Alright, empowering crystal, vines, red, uh, I don't remember what that one's called yet. Oh, iron bar, don't fall! No! Alrighty. Oh, nice! Spring! Okay, so we're getting, getting kind of beat up in here. Jeez. I have to really, like, abuse the spring here. I wonder if for some of those ones that, like, delete something, do they... I guess the ones that delete don't delete it until you leave. Oh, is this like a... Yes, okay, very cool. For some interesting puzzles. I bet we'll exhaust the spring before we, like, even. Oh no, we got back to full health. Okay. Hopefully, there's still a little bit more of that spring we can use. Darn it. Come on. Come on. Their movement patterns are so awkward. What the heck? What the heck? What? How? I don't understand. <laughs> Gosh darn it. Okay, we're gonna play again. That was frustrating. Uh, that we need a round two. We need a we need a rematch. I know we didn't lose that much stuff, but gosh darn. That's frustrating. That was frustrating. That was tough. Oh, everything about that run. Okay, get the map out of my face, please. Oh, these guys are the worst. All 
Alrighty. Ooh, and we got one of those. Cool. Ah, oh, this room looks difficult. At least these guys are really fast, so they kind of break away from the enemies. Hey, come on! Jeez. Oh no, too much delay after my attack. Are we gonna die again? You're kidding me. There's no way. There's no way I wasn't even close to that hitbox. Oh my goodness, we're gonna just play again. This is this is a rough day, guys. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Oh my goodness. Whew. Alright. I feel like the more frustrated and impatient we get, the worse we get at the game. No, 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 no. Oh, come on. What is going on? I feel like I'm playing a different game than I've been playing every other day. Alright, well, there's that. To this room. So we got some stuff. I need a spring. I'm telling you what. Also, next time we get a uh, crystallized energy, we're putting it in the five slot. Okay, let's see. Do we want to switch anything out of there? Flying golem egg. Definitely want to replace that with the vines. Glasses lens. Water sphere. Okay, otherwise I actually want to keep everything that's up here. I think. Okay, nice. Easy peasy room. Bunch of good stuff. And a spring. Excellent. Excellent. Anything else we want to switch out? I think this looks good. Actually, I don't know about teeth stones. I kind of want to put the water sphere there instead. Yep. These guys give me every time. What the heck? Oh boy. Okay, got a bunch of good stuff there. Oh, what is this? Uh, left or right, bottom or top. Okay. Um, we're definitely going to put these instead of probably these. And. Mm, mm, I don't know. I actually don't know for sure that these make potions, so I, I, don't, I don't really know what else they do. There's nine of them, though. Alright, well, either way, we're going to go get some some spring action. Alrighty, so this run is already going a little bit better than the other two. Okay. Hey, 
Come on! Nice! Oh, those guys make me so nervous. <laughs> Chests here. Let's see what we got. Uh, destroy something in the direction shown. Okay, so we'll just put it here so there's nothing there to destroy. Um, this one here. This one, what? Destroy something down to the right? Okay. Put it there. So it has to go to the left or right. Um, so this one. Here, this one. This is actually really fun having to kind of arrange them like that. Oh, and what's this one? There's another left or right. Okay, so oh, we're right around. I guess it's about time to go back then. Um, what are these? These are the gold runes, uh, which look pretty cool. What do we want to get rid of? Debating the broken sword or vines. Da, 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 da. Finds it is. All right, and we'll take the broken sword, and that'll be that. We'll probably just head back to town, I guess, because. We don't have a choice. <laughs> Our inventory is full. I mean, we might as well trudge on and see if we can... See if we can maybe get something, like, cooler or better. Like, replace more stuff with something better. actually fit? Oh, it all fit? Yeah, it just stacked on the stuff. Okay, cool. Um, yeah, so I think it's probably, probably about time. Dependent! Dependent on the pendant. There's our little channel there. Killed a bunch of little laser turret guys. Alrighty. A good haul! A good haul! For a beginner. Which I am. As of yet. Hopefully soon to not be. I mean, I don't feel like we're doing that terrible, right? I mean, it's it's very hard. And we're still, like, making money and making progress, and it's good. We just die sometimes. Nice, give me some of those Republic credits. I don't actually know what the currency is. Is it just gold? I forgot, has, has an NPC like said that they like referred to it as anything? Either way, today is the day. Sorry guys, I just love whacking the trees just in case there's something in there. Maybe I'll learn as I go on that this is the biggest waste of time. Maybe I should have learned that already. Since I'm here. Okay, alright. Alright, that's enough. I'm sorry. I will fight the urge to attack all the trees. Okay, so. Let's just open right up. Come on in! Give me just a quick second.
Okay, sorry about that, guys. Sorry about that. Some stuff to take care of there. Okay, back to game. up there. Um, this up there. And yeah, we'll see how that goes. Make it big. I feel like we got a lot more like kind of big items this time around. I don't necessarily- I'm, I'm, I'm gonna stop selling the crystallized energy just in case we're getting to where... Can these things stack on top of each other? Wow, we could have easily gotten more stuff. What the heck. Oh well. I feel like I have some of these. I'm gonna try and sell one. I'm gonna try and sell it for... 100. Let's see how that goes. And another one of these. Heck, let's sell, let's sell a teeth stone. We seem to actually find plenty of those. Let's sell it for 40. Let's see how that goes. Do we have any more stuff in here that we're trying to sell? A water lamp. See, I feel like these things are culture artifacts. I want to go talk to the culture artifact guy. Uh, is there something special that we do with them? Don't know. Gold runes. Hmm. Hmm. What to sell? Sell some foundry rest. We seem to find plenty of those. Let's see. Oh! I knew it. Okay, so... Foundry rest we can sell for more than 50. We'll just go up to 100. And the iron bars we can sell for more than 100. We'll go up to 140. Okay, so we, we, okay, there's all sorts of stuff we can sell then. Okie doke. Really? Okay, next time we're going right up to like, really? Okay, then we need to adjust this price. Wow. 70. And this one we're going to just go right up to 200. So it's a little too much, but they're still getting it. I'll say 150. Because 140 was a screaming deal, so we're going to say 159. 
Oh, mad about that price. It's too expensive for the teeth stone. I'll say 20. No way! Really? Those iron bars? Even 200 is like a screaming deal? That's nuts. Okay. Alrighty, so yeah, so I made a lot of money and learned some interesting things. Some very interesting things. So I'm gonna grab another hardened steel. Just one, just so that I kind of remember. Because um, I'll forget. Price, that was good. Okay, so this one, 200 is still a deal, so we're gonna just do 400. Just see what happens. <laughs> Alright, yeah, let's go back and explore. Cool stuff. Oh, we still got a bunch of stuff, though. Alright, we're basically just going to put as much as we can in here. Which is most of it. And then the rest in here. Alrighty. I wonder if there's a difference between those two chests. I kind of hope that, like... One of them doesn't delete stuff or something. Alrighty, back into the Golem Dungeon once more! Got a couple of minutes left, probably enough time for a run. Be cool to find the big boss again. Get a rematch. Drops cool stuff too, I think. Sorry if this is even a little... A little monotonous and redundant. I mean, there is a bit of rinse and repeat to the game, it seems like. It's fun that it randomizes it for you. Alrighty. Get some cool stuff already. Oh, and these guys give a bunch of hardened steel. Oh yeah, he gives me so much stuff. Oh my goodness. Um, what do we want up in here? Probably not the jellies. Kilk. Alright, I think it's about time to probably try the second one here. Let's see what's in here. Okay. I'm trying to remember, have I gotten in here before? Golem Dungeon 2. This is one of the strange devices that creature dropped when he fled. This one's rich, actually, almost quite literally rich. For every item you place into this device, gold of some perceived... Oh, yeah, definitely not. So what is this thing? Gold of some perceived value drops out. It's great if you need to use your pen in a pinch. The device looks like a mirror, so... I am just going to call it the mirror. Keeping it simple. I do wonder, though, where do the treasures drop inside go? Am I getting the best deal here? The mirror. Cool. Yeah, you put them in, you get, you get, you get gold. Okay. Um. Okay. Let's see. For instance, we put one of these in. Does it tell us how much we're gonna get? Doesn't look like it. It'd be nice to know. Um. Okay. Well, let's just try it. One jelly. Uh, we never sold a jelly, so that wouldn't really help us. Okay, well, I guess we just won't know. Uh, ow. Um, 
We don't have any potions or anything. I guess we should just leave. <laughs> yeah, I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Alrighty, so we'll probably do this, and then we might do another thing like what we did last time, where we just go in really quickly, and then uh, and then just kind of die <clears throat> to just take the first like five items. Because I don't think we have enough time to do another shopping day. Actually, we might. Yeah, actually, we might. So I'm just gonna grab everything that I can at least. Um. Yeah, we'll go from there. Let's open up shop. Still mad at that price, okay. Maybe these just like really aren't worth our time to sell even. Ten. Oh, a little bit bummed out by that, okay. Because 200 was still a screaming deal, so we'll say 350. Because they weren't mad, they were just kind of disappointed. 360. 369. Alright, let's see, let's see how far that gets us. He's still kind of bummed out. Yep, they like the iron bar. Okay, still a little much on that. Three twenty nine, maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, we got more stuff here. Oh, some of these on there. Oh, that one works. Three twenty nine. That's the good price. Okay, excellent. I am finding to get a lot of empowering crystals at this point, so let's just throw in. Let's put it in for 300. Really? Okay, so not even 10 on the on the teeth stone. Let's say six then. In which case, sell a couple of them at a time. Um, yeah, let's put out another one of these. Because you're angry at that in power crystal price. Say 200 then. Three of those. Try. No, I don't know. Try one more of these. All right, making bank, eating money. All right, we'll throw another iron bar in there. Why not? Or hardened one, rather. How do you feel about that? A little disappointed, but not bad. 
We'll do 179. We'll throw another golem core. Go. Mikey, he likes it. We'll do some more foundry rests. And let's see, let's see. Ah heck. Why not? Alrighty. Come on, don't end the day. I want to get to that 4,000. I want to do something at the at the forge. It's a little too much. Yeah, we'll just take five, maybe. Put it there. Okay, what do we have? What else do we like have in the storage? Okay, a bunch of these. Yeah, we'll grab some of those. Come on. Buy it. You know you want it. Sell two of these at once. Make some great bank. Oh, that's it. Okay, but we got the 4,000. We did it. Alrighty, so we're a little bit over the time there. Um, so that'll probably be it for today. Next time we're going to be doing something with that 4,000 gold. I remember that was kind of the threshold for being able to do stuff at the forge. I don't remember exactly what it was or what we were going to do. Hopefully we didn't sell the materials we need, but if we did, we can just go back into the dungeon. So that's it for today. Thank you so much for joining us. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe. And uh, check out my Patreon for, uh, for upcoming uh, videos and anything on the Urverse or the world of Earth.